Hey everyone, uh, Dan here. Just wanted to say a big thank you to everyone who has wished me uh, a happy birthday on my wall on Facebook. Uh, if you're not aware, today is the 16th of September of 2010, 16th September 2010, uh, which is my 39th birthday. So, um, woohoo, I made it this far. Uh, just a really big thank you if you have uh, gone to the effort of posting something on my wall or giving me a text message. I've got a couple of those today as well. Uh, or calling me, thank you, uh, I really appreciate the, the birthday messages, uh, I've had a great day, woke up by the kids, had some uh, brilliant breakfast, uh, thanks to my wonderful wife Mandy, um, kids gave me stacks of stuff, uh, Mandy got me a new watch, I'm very, very pleased with this because uh, my, my other watch which goes on my wrist keeps breaking. Uh, because my wrist apparently doesn't like watches. And this thing, uh, not the phone, but the case. It's really cool, nice colours. Because um, apparently this phone, you need a case to make it work. Who knew? Uh, as well as a wonderful treasure hunt. We do this every year. This is a big tradition that we... Um, uh, everyone gets this for their birthday and for Father's Day and Mother's Day. We... Uh, hide the presents around the house uh, and have clues leading from one present to the next. Um, so that's that's been a really good day. I'm going to have steak for dinner and some other stuff, which I don't know what it is, so I just know that it's steaks. And uh, I'm really looking forward to tonight. It's going to be nice, a nice relaxed dinner with the family. Um, if you're one of my Facebook friends, uh, then I want to make it a little more real. <clears throat> If you want to know what I would like from you for my birthday, um, you don't need to give me a present, that's it's fine. Um, I want to know if you can answer these two questions with certainty. Okay, you ready for it? So the first question is, if you were to die tonight, where would you go? Do you know for a fact where you would go? Um, heaven or hell? I'm not going to go with the worm food thing. Um... That's the first question. And the second question is related. If you appear before God and he says, why should I let you into my heaven? What would you say? If you've got a really certain answer for that, great. If you don't, if you're one of the vast number of people who has got no idea, uh, you might have gone to a, a religious school like I did. Um, I know some of my school friends are on Facebook, so yeah, you too. Uh, you might have gone to church all your life. You might, might never have gone to church. Uh, I'm not on about church. I'm on about faith. If you can't answer those questions, uh, or if there's some uncertainty there, can you do me one favor? It's going to take you about two hours, right? But you can split it up over a week, take about 15 to 20 minutes a day, tops. And that is to read the Gospel of Luke. I've got uh, copies of The Essential Jesus. Uh, this is just Luke's Gospel uh, in a really easy to read format. Um, it's exactly the same as the one you'll find in your leather bound, um, you know, King James Version Bible, except you can read that. It's a bit easier to read. Uh, I'm happy to post those out to people. Uh, if you're overseas, it's going to be a little more complicated. Uh, you might have a Bible at home that you've got access to and it's easy to read, then do that. Luke is the third gospel, so it's the third book in the New Testament. Uh, most, if not all, Bibles have got a contents page. And so you just look it up and go, Luke, he's about two-thirds of the way through. Read it. <clears throat> and instead of doing what I used to do, which was, what does the church say about this? Or how can I sort of make this say what I want it to say, what I'd like you to do is to say, what is God saying to me? What is Jesus doing? What is Jesus saying to people? How does Jesus respond to people? And finally, how do people respond to Jesus? It's a really important question that I'd like you to think through. That is the sum total of my desires. People say, oh, you know, what did you wish for on your birthday? What did you get? If all of my friends on Facebook read 
the Gospel of Luke over the next week and thought about what God was saying to them and thought about what's this got to do with me. The guy was 2,000 years ago and came to some sort of conclusion about Jesus, my life would just be absolutely bedazzled. It would be huge. Um, not because I would have any kudos, but because I would have so many people who go, hey, you know what? I think I'm a bit better off with Jesus now. Um, if, you're, if you can answer those questions, uh, then I would say still read the Gospel of Luke. It's good value. And if you read it and go, I don't get what this is about. I don't know why Jesus said that. Then uh, message me. I'm happy to answer questions. Uh, and if you get a copy of The Essential Jesus, uh, and you say on page 28, uh, line 10, what's this about? I can actually look it up on mine. Uh, if you don't, and you've got um, you know, your, own, your own Bible uh, at home, uh, then feel free, chapter, verse, that's fine. I'm good with that. I, I just would really like to see uh, you, my friends, reading uh, this part of God's Word. I believe it's God's Word to us. Uh, and seeing how that affects you, how you should live with that. Um, so if you've got a question, just message me, call me, knock on my door, something like that. Um, and, but if you could do this, if you are someone who says, yeah, I think I'll do that, then let me know. That would be really cool. Um, post on my wall, message me, something like that. I'd really like to know how many people decide to just take up this challenge. It, you know, 15 minutes a day and you'll be done in seven or eight days tops. It's not a really huge call. If you catch the train in the morning... Uh, then boom, done. If you uh, if you do a bit of reading before you go to bed, easy. Uh, I would just be really encouraged to find out that some of my friends uh, develop their relationship with God a little bit more. Yeah, that's all for now. Thank you very much.